Let's get into the rest of the West, what those other three dweebs are up to. So the Seattle Seahawks, they fall to the Minnesota Vikings. I did not pick this game correctly. I did think that the Seahawks would win this game. The Seahawks dropped to one and two, and I'll be honest, guys, their defense is a problem. They're not looking too good on defense. They're, the second half Seahawks are a different team than the first half Seahawks, and I'm not sure what's going on in that locker room, but those orange slices are going bad or something. That Gatorade is maybe a little too warm. Something's going on in that locker room where they all go in there and then they just come out not good at football <laughs> in the second half. I was going to get a lot more mean there, but I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to save it. I'm going to save it for later in the season, I think, because... I mean, look at look at this. Though. Like the Seahawks, they play at the 49ers. That game's at 1:05 p.m. Uh, Pacific time on Fox. Uh, we'll look at the distribution map here in a in a minute, but uh, th- they have this game, and the San Francisco 49ers gave the the Packers one heck of a game last week. We'll talk about that in a second, but I, I don't know if the Seahawks can win this game. And then after that, the Rams play the Seahawks. Could the Seattle Seahawks really start one and four? I think it's very, very possible. And then at that point, I think it's time for the Seahawks to put on their panic pants because uh, that's that's a tough climb. Being one and two uh, with two teams being three and oh in the NFC West, that's already one heck of a climb. So Seattle, if they drop to one and four, I don't know if they do anything cool this year. The Green Bay Packers uh, defeated the San Francisco 49ers last week on Sunday Night Football. That game was 30 to 28. Those 49ers started celebrating. Oh, they were celebrating. 37 seconds left. They go up. Oh, man. They go up by a point. But there's this dude. You guys may have heard of him. Aaron Rodgers. A Rodge. He comes in and uh, no timeouts and just, you know, does Aaron Rodgers things. But also, by the way, the 49ers, I mean, do they know the Packers roster? The only guy that... That, that Rodgers likes to throw to is Devontae Adams. You don't even cover him? That's on you, Niners, all right? That's on you. Uh, we already talked about their game, though. They do host the Seattle Seahawks on Fox. And I'll be honest, guys, I like because Jimmy, he's he goes so back and forth, like wildly. Like he had that that fumble where he just like, uh, wh- whatever he was, do- just dropped it into the ground for a fumble. And then he does that last drive where he just marches down, makes a bunch of big-time throws and, and scores and takes the lead again. And you got to think that there's only two, three, four quarterbacks in the entire NFL that would have come back and won that game like Aaron Rodgers did. He is one of those. So, I mean, that's that's tough. But I, I, I still think that that team gets better once Trey Lance starts playing. And the Arizona Cardinals, they had to come back a little bit on the Jacksonville Jaguars. That game was 31-19 to in favor of the Cardinals. Cardinals are now 3-0 for the first time since 2015. They get up that wild kick return, the kick six on a 68-yard field goal attempt, which, by the way, awful call to even try that. Like, what, what, like I don't know if he thought that that would still just be a touchback, but that was a bad call. A 109-yard return, and that was pretty awesome. But they, uh, the Cardinals responded really well. They had two picks and three sacks on rookie quarterback, first overall pick Trevor Lawrence, who the Rams will see on December 4th. And I will see you on December 4th at SoFi Stadium because I will be there. And uh, it'll be awesome. But uh, with that, though, the Arizona Cardinals do play at the L.A. Rams, 1.05 p.m. Pacific time on Fox. Uh, not the game of the week this time. I'm a little bit disappointed yet. 3-0 and versus 3-0, and NFC West, best division in football, except for the Seahawks, who are like not holding their weight here. And we still don't, we like barely get, like we get little specks of cities all over, but it's not the game of the week or anything like that, so. You guys made it all the way to the end of the video. Do you know what that means? That you're the best. You're the absolute best. What I need from you now, if you have not already, go ahead on this side, you can subscribe. And if you like this clip, I guarantee you're gonna like the entire thing. That's gonna be on this side here. Peace, go Rams.